everybody welcome back to my channel it's mr green hands and thank you for watching um it's always great to see when you've grown something and you see the results of it even if this was my first time planting ginger i have to admit that i actually was shocked in the results of how it did i am really happy to see it growing it's really really amazing for a first time ginger grower I am very happy to see it grow. So in today's video, I'm just going to give you an absolute quick update on how my ginger turned out when I planted it three weeks ago. I made a video about it. That was my first time planting it. You guys can check it out back. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hit it as a suggestion video. You guys can go back and recap on how it looked from then to how it looks now. So this is how it looks now. It's actually growing into a full fledged tree or plant and it's got this beautiful small leaf here and it's getting better and if you guys can see closely that it's actually starting to put another one there it's starting to open up more so i was going to transplant it into a bigger pot by separating each individual one but i'm thinking i'm just going to keep this together and actually transplant the whole thing into a bigger pot so we can have and guys i don't know if you guys can really see closely in between these two other ginger which is sprouting there's a young sprout that's coming through and i don't remember seeing that on the, the ginger that i planted because there was only one starting to grow from that ginger rhizome before i continue the video i just want to say drop a yes or no in the comment section should i separate the rhizomes or should i just keep it together let's continue the video you guys remember in the video that I put out, I planted three ginger that I got and I really was hoping that it all grew, but unfortunately one did not make it. But even though one didn't make it, I'm still very happy because look how beautiful this one has grown and it's growing out of proportion i definitely need to get this in a bigger pot in the come upcoming weeks and when that beautiful sunshine comes out i'm gonna pop this bad boy in the summer outside to let it get all that vitamin d the rich nourishment and i'm gonna give it a little bit of fertilizer natural fertilizer you guys can see me doing that in that process and getting it to produce a beautiful succulent rhizomes underneath the soil so to get me constantly trying to do this so i'm really have i'm actually i'm on i'm actually quite happy to actually see them grow um i think to me they're like little babies so you whatever you put into them and whatever you influence them by you're more likely to have a fantastic plant so treat them correctly thank you there was only a quick update i just wanted to show you guys that so thank you guys for watching and don't forget to like comment and definitely subscribe if you love what i'm doing and you guys have no idea what there is more videos coming up about growing things and taking care of this planet and actually using everything around us to be able to produce something so thank you again guys and stay blessed